If there's one thing I know about Italian families is that they're better than everybody in two different things. One, talking louder than anybody else around them, or two, bringing everybody together for a meal that seems endless. They've managed to find the balance between quality and quantity that seems to be an Italian pattern, and there is one restaurant in Yale Town named La Pentola that is marrying these unique aspects with authenticity. Being voted one of Vancouver's best new restaurants in 2013 by Vancouver Magazine, it's just one of the many accolades that La Pentola has received since it opened in the fall of 2012. But the recognition is second to the continued vision that is shared by Adam Pegg and Lucas Sim. Although their food speaks for itself by using fresh and local ingredients that keeps the spirit of its inspiration country alive, it's their unique style of dining, a la familia, that maintains the essence of every Italian meal. With a wide selection of dishes prepared with authenticity, the Pensola focuses on bringing families together for a dinner that is traditionally Italian with a West Coast flair. Nose the Tail's always been there. The idea that you use the whole of an animal or the whole of an ingredient, be it a, a vegetable or an animal or a fish or whatever. Uh, it is important um, to use these things, uh, for one, because of sustainability. I really believe that the philosophy of Italian cooking is um, what I believe in. Uh, simple, beautiful ingredients, uh, well taken care of, simply prepared, and uh, used and delivered to show the greatness of that ingredient. Italian dining in um, you know family homes. We enjoy people sitting at their table and sharing the meal together. I think it's a great way to eat. I like to do it. Uh, we like to surprise people by having them uh, uh, have dishes that come to the table they don't know what's going to come next. You know, just enjoying a whole evening, and that's what it's about. Just to enjoy yourself. Our uh, burrata feature tonight. So we've got our nice blanched almonds. Mm. So we've just taken them out of the shell. We're just going to chop them uh, roughly. Taking some nice organic kale from our friends at Hennebrook Farm. Got a little chive, a little parsley. And add a little bit of radish. And have a little bit of uh, white wine vinegar, mm -hmm. just a smidge. And then we use a particularly nice olive oil for uh, darker greens. And then my favorite part again. Oh, look at that. Here we go. Oh wow. Like, there's no way that I can possibly explain what this cheese tastes like because it's completely unique. And remember when he was saying about like different olive oils for different things, you can definitely taste the difference. It's brilliant. So good. I really like the cocktails here. Yeah, you know, yeah. So that, yeah, that's, um, what is it called? Uh, oh yeah, what are you having? Yeah. Yeah, so I'm having this um, Cohiba Old Fashioned. Oh, nice. Yeah, so the first time we had it, they just killed me. It was yeah. Okay, yeah. And then the food, we like the, the fact that, you know, we just order several different things. Yeah. And just uh, try everything, and the uh, taste is really kind of sophisticated, you know. And the portions are large enough that you can all share. Yes, and yes, have we all share, everything. yeah. With its communal table atmosphere, authentic Italian dishes, and unique nose to tail cooking, La Pentola is one of the top destinations in Vancouver when it comes to dining out and still connecting with those around you over award winning food. No matter the dynamic, you will always manage to sacrifice of sitting next to your second cousin twice removed as long as the Pentola's passionate chefs are at the helm of your dining experience. I'm Asa Six of Four Nom Nom and this has been your La Pentola experience. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for amazing restaurants. If you know a place that we should feature, leave a comment below and release your Nom Stuff. Six oh four Nom Nom. The mushrooms are more expensive than the fish in that plate right there. But then again, I'm no fishmonger. Is that what it is? A fishmonger? You're not a fisherman, are you? You're a fishmonger? You're asking the wrong people. Really? <laughs> You're like, I just do camera work. I don't know. I don't know. You pretend like it's your So today on Cooking with Ace, um, we're going to be making like a really nice Barata. I need to find the name of the fish. <laughs> Could you imagine if I was left to my own devices?